What is up, heroes? It's Simonite Zero, and welcome back to Let's Play Celeste Blind. In the last episode, we started our ascent, or rather, our, our we started our final ascent to the summit, where we're going through these little sections that are based off of mechanics from all the different chapters. It's been a really cool, um, really cool experience so far, and I am joined by my puppy today, who has reclaimed her privileges in the basement. Those of you know that in the past, uh, she has barked to the point that it was not exactly uh, feasible for her to be down with me, but we'll see how it goes today. Uh, we've got a strawberry in the top right corner that we're gonna need to get. Oh, oh, I can hang on to that wall. That's helpful. Oh, wait a minute. What was I doing? I was impatient. I obviously had to uh, wait for that diamond to reappear. Wait a moment, and we're good. We're good until we just run into the wall. <laughs> Gotta love that. But yeah, I'm excited to hop back into this. I love the aesthetics. I think that's one of the like cool parts about this final level. I love in general when final levels kind of like allude to the journey along the way, you know? Everything you've overcome trying to make it to the end. Alright. Oh, I see. Oh wait, what? <laughs> I tried to dash it straight down, but uh, that obviously didn't happen. At least not as planned. I can actually afford to use the second dash there, just to make my life a little bit easier. I should be a little bit more patient. Still a little bit too fast there. There we go. Oh wait, no. That time I waited a little bit too long, so I didn't have enough uh, vertical height to make it over. There we go. Alright. On to the next section. What do we have here? I think... Hmm. <laughs> I think... But uh, that was not the way to go about it at first. Now we got one of those guys. Interesting. Anything else of interest? I don't want to miss out on any secrets or anything, you know? Ooh, the strawberry down there. And it looks like there's something up there. So, I want to get this strawberry first and then head up on that upper left corner. You know what this reminds me of? Oh, what's the... I forget. I think it's like Magna Centipede, maybe? Um, where from Mega Man X2, where you're trying to get the helmet upgrade. You have to... Or not, you're not getting the helmet upgrade, you have to use the helmet upgrade in order to climb up that wall. You have to use, like, Flame Stag's uh, ability to dash across or whatever. Or just get, like, a really good jump. Um, okay, I think I've got an idea of how I want to do this. Nice. Do I want to hang on to this first? Can I, like, jump over? Oh, there's a platform here! I didn't even realize that. That makes life a lot easier. Aw. <laughs> I was waiting for it. I was like, oh, wait a minute. I am probably not in the right position. Oops. I should probably just try going straight back to the left, and if I do it quickly enough, I will not have fallen too far. It should be alright. I think that'll be my next attempt. That was obviously way too quick. There we go. Alright, now we can go back up here. And 
and see what's up here. Ooh, the music changed and everything. What's going on up here? I obviously can't go, or no, I can go back down, which means I, or I hope there's a strawberry all the way on the right side, and then we'll make our way back, and then can go back down, and then continue to the right again, which is like the main part of the level, I guess. Hmm. How to go about that section? Okay, that works. We unlocked a B-side, woo! Big fan, oh, so nice that it takes us all the way back like that. Very much appreciated. I probably should have done a little bit more planning before just jumping into it like that. All right, so I'm gonna wanna cling onto that wall up there. Let's do that. Okay, jump. I definitely underestimated how far I would go with that jump. I was like, I really need to jump to make sure I'm going to make it across. And then, uh, definitely overdid it. Okay. Ah. I was feeling a little bit pressured, like I had to, you know, react in the moment and try and figure out what I should be doing. But, for the most part, that wasn't too terrible of a section. Alright. Darn. Just a little bit too slow there. Oh, you know what? I can probably speed up that section. I don't need to. But I probably can. Yeah, by doing something like that. It might make life a little bit easier, or maybe... Make the cycles a little bit better or something? I don't know. Oh, I should have just dashed to the wall! Wait, what? Oh. Apparently that's something I need to work on. My, uh, controller control. Alright. Now we are good. Oh, and this these couple of these are moving pretty quickly. We've got the strawberry in the center. Hmm. How are we gonna want to go about doing this? What I'll need to do is land on that center platform, jump up and get the strawberry, and then after getting the strawberry, get the crystal, and then without landing on that middle platform, drop down and then go to the right and climb back up. So Oh, you know, from the middle platform, I'm going to probably have to jump on that right floating platform if I want to be able to get both the uh, the crystal and the strawberry. Hmm. This is going to be tough. <laughs> Can't even make it to the, the part that was concerning me the most. Oops. That was a bit too much. But I think that was still the right idea, at least. Ah, I dropped way too low there. Oh, why did I not react to getting it? Darn. There we go. Okay, so now... We need to get that little guy there. Okay, I guess that works. Just kind of winging it there, because I can't really get a good perspective on the level from where we are right now. I feel like there's something hidden down there. You know what? I want to see what happens if we don't get this card. Oh, no, there's nothing there. At least... Noteworthy, in my opinion. Oh man. 
felt like I needed to land on one of those to refresh my, my jump, but uh, obviously need to do it very quickly. Wait, why didn't I... Okay. Excellently timed, Nick. Excellently timed. There's the impatience coming in. Darn. You know what, I wonder if I even need to dash between the second one and the first one. Like, is it possible to just jump and then... Mm, not really. What if I were to jump on this one, and so I saved two of my dashes that way? Let's see here. Yeah, so I think that's what I'm going to try and do. Is just jump onto the first one, that way I have two dashes going into that final segment. Ooh, this can be close. Alright, I'm pretty sure there's a secret down here. Ooh, and there is. What are we gonna find? What? What is that? Is that a gem of some sort? Oh, I have to... Of course, this is Celeste. I need to work for every secret I find. Um, okay. Ooh, that last bit's gonna be tough. Interesting. Oh, almost. Cool, did it. Wait, get the gem. What do I... I was like, wait a minute, what do I do? What did I get? Is it gonna tell me, like, was that a special thing I unlocked, or... I don't know. Um, okay, I guess. I'm sure we'll maybe find out later on. There's, like, some collectibles section I'll find. Either way, don't die here. <laughs> Anything over this way? I knew it. Okay. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I gotta get more, like, aerial height so I can drop in at my own uh, timing, per se. There we go. Woo! Alright, that was a pretty simple, Strawberry. Um... Cool. Onward we go. We're, I think we're cruising through this level pretty quickly, in my opinion. Well, actually, it's been almost like 15 minutes. Uh, so, maybe not super quickly, but not slowly, at least in my opinion. Aw, oh, really? <laughs> I guess I misjudged that. Okay. No going back, I guess. One of the things you guys have commented on pretty consistently is that um, I can climb up or cover more like uh, vertical distance more efficiently if I were to climb up rather than kind of like wall jump up. So believe me, I am listening. Oh wait, what? I thought I did diagonal up so that I could cling onto that wall, but I guess not. Cool. Made it through there. Nothing else hiding? Hmm. There's one little area that looks suspicious, but maybe not. Alright. Now we get a cool battle in moment. Big fan, big fan. Oh wait, I should have, uh... Where do I go? Okay. Um... Oh! <laughs> I see what happened there. Wait, now what? What was I supposed to do as a result of that? Oh! Hey! 
and we get propelled even further. Nice. So we cleared that little section. I hope Mr. Oshiro is okay. Why? He treated you like garbage. Yeah, but I still care about him. You can still care about people that do horrible things. Uh, and that you still want the best for them, you want them to improve. Uh, just because one person inflicts suffering on others shouldn't necessarily mean you want to inflict suffering on them. And you didn't have to snap at him like you did. Whatever. I mean it. You're way too aggressive. Well, you put too much energy into bad people who will just end up hurting you. I mean, both of them are right here, right? It's a balance. Mr. Oshiro wasn't a bad person. He transformed into a monster. He tried to hurt you. And now you're defending him? I'm not defending him. I'm on your side here. I'm mad at him too. I might still be in that hotel if you hadn't forced the issue. But I still hope he's alright. Okay. I'm sorry for snapping at Mr. Oshiro. Thanks. It's in the past now. 2,000 meters. Okay. Ooh, and the music changes yet again. Very cool. Okay. Reintroducing this concept. Ooh. Let's see what's going on over here. Really? Nothing? There's got to be something going on over here. Right? But what? Ah. There's the connection. But then what? <laughs> that doesn't help much. Anything more to do? No? Hmm. Alright, well, I guess we'll head over. Oh, that's right, and the screen transitions. The screen transitions refresh our, um... Our double jumps, right? Yeah, I think they do, so... We are probably going to need to use that to our advantage. Um... This looks like an area we can go up. Yeah. Okay. How about up here? No? No? Alright, we're, we're gonna die then. Alright, at least it starts us back over here. Hmm. Okay. This is kind of a tough one then, right? Oh, man. How am I gonna get around there? I don't know. That's cutting it really close. Because whatever I do, I'm gonna have to get on the le I would have to get on the left side of this, and then have still have one of my dashes, like I just did with that platform there. But it's going to be really difficult to make it over there. Hmm. Is there something else I'm just not aware of or missing? I don't know. Let's see, if I were to do this maybe and like latch on and then slide down. I could maybe make it work. Oh, but that's... Even that is proving to be really difficult. Oops. That should not have been what I did. Yeah, we're, uh, we're toast again. This might be one of those where they say, hmm, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to come back to this one. Because it's already looking pretty grim. I think I might be able to do that, where if I get enough horizontal er, horizontal and vertical distance, I can drift back to cling onto the wall. I think that's my best bet, but even then it's looking like, it'd have to be really precise. Close. 
but no cigar. Oh man. I think if I do the diagonal up left jump, I may be able to get enough height to be able to drift to the left past it and then just dash straight up. There we go. All right, so got another jewel thing. I don't really know what it is slash what it does, but um, I guess we'll take those. What is, I, I like forget what these do. Oh, that's right. I guess that is a thing. All right, so we got ourselves another collectible. Good job, guys. Oh, that's right. <laughs> these bounce like that. I'm not a fan of this type of mechanic, admittedly. Oh, I should have just... Is it possible to get up there? Or... Oh, wait, no, that's where we fell down from, I think. There is it? <laughs> I forgot to input the direction. Lovely. And for some reason, I felt like I was falling on the green ball there. Forgive me, guys. I promise. This isn't rust. This is just something on a whole other level. Um, okay. Anything over this way? No? Okay. If you say so, Celeste, I'll keep moving. Ah, and here come the winds. Here come the winds. Keep fighting, Madeline. I believe in you. Anything up there? No? Okay. Alright. Then down we fall. Boing. Oh, wait. That did not go as planned. I definitely need to save one of my dashes for that component. Should have held directly up. Also, why did I try to... It's just me getting impatient. Oh, nope, keep going, Madeline. All right, there we go. <laughs> lovely, just lovely. That time I was too afraid of not, or of drifting ahead of it like I did last time. Well, this is not going to work, but um, that's because I panicked and used my second dash. Okay, this, this, refresh. There we go. And the wind dies down a little bit. Okay, so we don't have quite as much resistance as we did before. Definitely some, though. Oh, and we have some stuff flying at us, it seems. Ooh. That was, uh, that was pretty close. Oh, and there's a strawberry down there? Oh, we have to go for it, then. Hmm. Let's plan out how we want to do this. Wait, there's... Oh, I'm gonna have to jump on one of those. Alright. Let's do this, then. I guess I'm gonna need to be ready to dash immediately after that. There we go. Let's see, anything up there? No. Alright. Huh. What's the plan there? I don't know what I'm supposed to do after that part. It just doesn't look like there's enough. Like, I can jump here, but I'm not gonna make it very far.
I don't really see much of a way around this. Do you guys? I'm sure some of you do, who have, you know, beaten the game before, maybe. But... Oh, wait a minute, that's right, I can change the, uh, the level... Like, the height of that, by, like, hitting down and stuff. That's right. That's the rust speaking, guys. My bad. Oh, but I need to be standing on top of it for that to happen. Okay. Alright, we're, we're back in business, guys. Uh, you go down there, and I think we're okay for the most part, except now I need to, hmm, do I need to ride that down? How do I make that work? Do I need to, like, cling onto its side? No! <laughs> Why did I do that? Uh, I didn't gain anything from that. Not even useful information. Oh, wait, nope, that's... That ain't it. Okay. So let me see if I can cling to the side. Or is it possible to, like, flip the direction? No. So I don't know how I would get it down. Oh! I need to jump on this to move it out of the way so the block moving to the right can go through there and then I can land on that and then try to like double, oh and I have to go up and then land on it on th the right side of this column I'm currently standing on, direct it upwards and then double dash off of it, gotcha, gotcha, alright. I see, it's all coming together. Oh, I totally forgot about... Darn. Okay. I have to pay attention at that last part. Make sure it doesn't... Oh, wait, no! No, hurry! Aw, oh, man. I missed my jump. But we'll persevere. We will climb Mount Celeste. I assure you. Alright, that should be on track. Move you out of the way. Come up here. Bring you up. And we're good. I have seen the way. Oh, wait. No! No, come back! <laughs> I thought I was gonna have to, like, manipulate that to the left or right at all, but, uh, turns out I did not. I probably got a little bit too far ahead of myself there. Do that. Aw, oh, man. This looks like a really cool segment, though. Oh man, that was too much as well. Probably delay that a little bit. There we go. Ooh, what's on here? There's totally a strawberry on the left side. There's totally a strawberry on the left side. I can just, like, feel it. Oh, there totally is! How do I get it over there, though? Right? I don't know. Hmm. I guess that kind of works? Oh no, it has to be solid ground. Huh. I think what I'll need to do is potentially fall back down after making my way up. Let's see if I can at least take a look at the rest of the, or, you know, the layout of the level. Great job, great job. Okay, to the left, and to the right. Yeah, that's totally what I need to do. So I just need to make it to the top first, and then fall down, and then somehow make it back? Hmm. That will be, that will be a tough one. 
but we'll figure it out when we get there. Oh no! Hmm. Yeah, I don't see how I'd really be able to even make it back after getting the strawberry, admittedly. I mean, this part itself is not too bad. He says as he gets out of himself and ends up dying. But it's really not. Just trying to survey the, the landscape. I don't think it would be too easy to make it all the way back down to the arrow, like, box. Right? It's like from here, could I make it back down? Oh, it's not even gonna let me. Interesting. Okay, I've got an idea. That was not the idea, guys. <laughs> I promise. Have a little bit more faith. Okay. Darn it. <laughs> so the the idea, because I haven't executed it yet, is going to be to dip down, grab the strawberry, and then dash to the wall. Why did I do that? And then dash to the wall while saving one of my dashes so that I can jump off of the wall and then dash to the diamond to refresh my double dashes to make it back up. I'm thinking that'll work. Yeah. So I didn't do the whole part where I saved- Oh, I could have done it! I could have done it! I didn't do the whole thing where I saved one of my dashes. Here we go. Huh. But I didn't save two of my jumps. I don't see myself getting back up. Right? Yeah, I don't know how else I would climb back up. Is it possible to even? I mean, it's obviously got to be possible. Like, they wouldn't create an uncompletable puzzle. But... I guess I'm just not seeing how it would work out. Right? Like, there's no way I could climb this segment. I don't know. Is it possible to shift these to the left or right? No. Hmm. Yeah, I'm having a tough one with this, or a tough time with this one, guys. have any idea? Because I certainly do not. And they don't even let me go down far enough. Yeah, there's no way I can climb up without the platform. That makes it seem like I need the platform then if I want to have any chance at getting this. Like... I feel like that's what I need to do. So if you could see when the platform was moving up, the left edge of it was sticking out on the left side. So so I think I would need to cling onto that as it's going up. Ooh, that's, that's gonna make this a lot more difficult. All right, let's give it a go. Oh man. Okay, yeah, I think that's the idea though. 
Wait, why did I do that? Come on. Yeah, that's exactly what I have to do. All right, I think I think I can do that. I know I, I know I can do that. Oh man, why did I go directly to the right? I wanted to diagonal up. Oh, what? I thought I grabbed it. No. I guess I didn't go all the way to the right, so I didn't cling onto it. But yeah, I think that's what I'll have to do. So the the key there was seeing how much it overlapped there and to see that you could actually cling it cling to the block on the other side. That was the the big tell for how to do this. Oh, but I didn't jump quickly enough. Darn, that's going to be tough to make it over that last spike hurdle. But, at the very least, in general, now I feel a lot more confident um, that I can actually get this strawberry and I'm not just wasting my time. Wait, what? I was supposed to be up and left. Uh, wasting my time on, you know, pointless strategies or whatever. Too big of a jump, but that's okay. Uh, oh wait, darn it, I actually made it. I did not anticipate making it, so I was ready to just continue onward, but nope. Again, I, I held down all the jump button for too long there, so I had too, too full of a jump. I did it again! <laughs> Why do I keep overestimating my jump? Or underestimating, rather. No! This is not gonna be it. This ain't it. No. My apologies for taking so long on this. Although, those of you that are still watching at this point are probably here for this type of uh, experience. For watching somebody die over and over and over trying to get these things. And a lot of you guys were actually um, really reassuring in telling me that like you were looking forward to seeing me try to get all the strawberries and everything. Which, which means a lot because I know that it's a lot of me dying, it can be a lot of repetitive, it can be some frustration, some raging at times. I'm generally not one to rage. Uh, so I wouldn't, if that is why you're sticking around to see the b-sides and the strawberries and all that jazz, um, it's probably not the best use of your time. Oh, so close! So close! Darn. I'm gonna have to be fast. Nice! Woo! Made it pass. It only took forever. And let's see, how much further do we have to go in this? We can go to either the left or the right. Oh uh, man, I don't know which one is the... Because I feel like it's... Okay, this is the one. Oh, we're not allowed to... We can't dash at all, right? That's what that does. Yeah, okay. Huh. Or I just have to be really fast. Ooh. But I was not fast enough there. Oh, I probably need to dash from underneath. Yeah. Oh, or wait a minute, because of the... I can actually wall climb up that. Good to know. All right, I've got an idea. Oh wait, no. <laughs> we did not make it over there in time, unfortunately. But I can get a lot closer than I originally thought. Nice. So we got that. Okay. 
I should not have used both of my dashes there. Actually, yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Rather than have to deal with the cloud at all. Alright, what do we have here? Up. How do I go up? Oh, I have to climb up there, probably. I want to be able to get the strawberry, but I do want to see if... Oh man, I, it was too early again. If this is um, an area that I can even go up. And it looks like I would come out back at the start of this area anyway, so it's probably not necessary to try to get both the strawberry and... Oh! Interesting. So that's not in uh, like a secret area. Interesting. I think if I do that launch diagonal upright, I'll actually be just fine. I don't need to go straight up and then dash to the right because I'll have too much um, horizontal momentum that way because of the wind. Cool. Now, the question is, where was the secret area that led to that top section? I guess I, I won't ever know. <laughs> no, I, I will. All in good time. Oh, no! No! Hmm... Okay! We made it through there. Just kind of winging it there, but we, we survived. Alright. It seems we are almost at the end of this little segment. Oh, wait a minute. I'm gonna have to, uh do this again probably yeah because I need to progress the the battle in purple circles in order to make it to like the final launch or whatever ooh that was uh that was a close one. Oh no that was too much Darn. Made some good progress, but uh, did not react appropriately there, unfortunately. And I don't really need to do a whole lot on this, I don't think. Oh, whoa, that was potentially bad. But we're alright. Okay. And kaboom! Whew! Made it through that segment. That was a close one. It was. That was a long stretch there where we were just relying on battling. Yeah, I wasn't sure if we'd make it. Maybe you were right. Maybe this is too dangerous. No. I was wrong. We can climb this mountain. I've got your back. Aw, the power of friendship. And I believe in you. That means a lot to me. Aww. I love this. It's so, like, feel good. It's so heartwarming. And now, we are at 2,500 meters. Alright. Well, it's obviously been a much longer episode than the previous one, and it seems we still have quite a bit of climbing to go, so I hope you guys are looking forward to the next segment just as much as I am. But until the next episode, this is Moon Knight Zero, and this mission is complete. <laughs>